Everybody pray for me. It's been a day for me. Yeah, yeah. It's currently like 11 p.m. in Vegas, but it's like the only time I can actually work on something without dying in the heat. It's still like 100 degrees outside right now, but it's night out, so it's a little bit cooler. There's no sun beating on you. But I'm going to continue with the 150cc GY6 into my 50cc scooter swap right now. I'm going to strip the scooter completely down as much as I can tonight, get the motor pulled out because it's time to order the new motor and um, get everything ready. I'm planning on rebuilding the whole thing. Um, I want to keep it like a stunt scooter so I might cage it on the outside of the scooter but I'm going to strip everything down. I'm going to be getting a new exhaust, new grips for it, everything like that. I'm literally building the whole scooter from a from the frame up and gonna make it super beast, super reliable. Probably after I get the motor installed, probably shortly after, um, big bore kit 171, I think, 173cc big bore kit into the 150cc GY6 motor. But yeah, so sorry if that's a lot of information, but uh, I'm gonna pull the scooter out and get started on stripping it down. Got it all pulled out now. This video is really just gonna be me stripping everything down, so it's gonna be a lot of fast forwarding, but then I'm gonna talk about some plans after that. But uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and start working on it. Got complete handlebar stripped down, just have the uh, front brake just so I can wheel it around. I'm gonna keep the engine in with the wheel on because that's the only way I can get it to roll. If I have the engine in, so I'm gonna keep that in there. Um, I'm about to strip off the gas tank and after that, it's gonna be completely stripped. But other than that, I'm gonna start cleaning everything up and call it a night here. But I wanna know what you guys think I should paint the frame. I was thinking maybe white on the frame, but uh, I'm not sure. So you guys, Leave a comment below on what color you guys want to see for the frame and uh, anything else you want to see on this build. This is how I did my wheelie pegs, by the way. With all the two, uh, look at that, the weld's not even all the way around at all. Yeah, it's dangerous. Well, the two uh, bars and the well, the pegs down. Same on this side. This one got bent in the crash the other day. So I had to straighten that out. But this frame is pretty light. But I kind of want to see if I can make it lighter in different ways. Maybe cut things out. Find out what's not needed. So that's gonna do it for this video, guys. I'm just finishing up putting all the uh, pieces away. Everything. Um, need to order the motor soon. Get that mounted up. Make sure we get it all figured out and weld what we need to weld for a motor mount. And then after that, it's take the motor back out, strip it, paint it, and build it up from there. But definitely the next step is ordering the motor and getting that mount in. It's going to be fun. There's probably going to be some headaches. I guarantee there's going to be some problems along the way. But it's going to be a quick-ass stunt moped. Um, the 150 motor in here. Probably big bore that. And it's going to be super fun. So if you're stoked for that, make sure to leave a thumbs up for this video. You guys can buy your Mop Boy stickers. Just uh, leave my email in the link below. You guys can email me and get some Mop Boy stickers. Um, we're bringing mopeds back, and this thing's gonna be so fun. So many videos, so many wheelies. It's gonna be fun. I'll see you guys in the next one.